Welcome back, laddies, and today we are here, and I'm going to be showing you a few Irish phrases, or actually five Irish phrases. If you can see back there, that says Pokemon. If you're a kid, don't read it, just skip past. Anyway, guys, because that is an Irish slang word. I know it says kiss my butt, but the butt isn't supposed to be there. It's supposed to be something different. It's supposed to be kiss me Iris, but Minecraft it would blur it out and me personally I'm a, I'm more of a kids youtuber but I mean if you want some Irish slang there you have it um it's actually one of the words I use in many bullies that are like American or British or something like that and they have no clue what I'm talking about um also I'm gonna involve one more phrase because I forgot to add it onto the signs and see back there I have the Irish flag but anyway, time to get onto it. So right here we have diagwit, and that means hello. Diagwit equals hello. Pogmohon. Not gonna say the bomb one. Slan, which is by Slan. Scriv. Now some of these are actually spelled wrong, so I'm sorry. I'm not the best Irish speller, but I can definitely say these words. Scriv. Or Shkriv is what we just say it as, like Shkriv, Shkriv, which means right. Oh, by the way, um, I'm going to involve a little bit on why the... Now, some people don't know why Irish people don't speak much Irish anymore. But if you're instead of a Gaeltic area, that means um, Irish-speaking area, or guelga speaking area. Uh, kind of like Tory Island. That's a really big place for um, Gaeltic. I know, right here we have lap. Oh, excuse me. <coughs> oh, God. Sorry. Anyway, um, lower, which equals book. Low. Lower. So, those are the. Oh, yeah, also letterist, which means toilet, which should have been right here. Should have been. But anyway, la. Oh, sorry. Letterist. Letterist. So those are the six Irish words or phrases or whatever you want to call them. Now it's time to tell you why most Irish people don't speak Irish anymore. So first of all, this flag here means everything to me. This here right here means everything to me. Ulster, Connacht, Munster, all those. This flag represents Ireland and I love this flag. It means everything to me. Anyway, enough of the sob. So the reason why we don't actually speak Irish anymore, any British per person that's watching, don't feel bad for yourself. These, this is the nine, this is like the, the 1400 British people. So don't feel bad for yourself, <laughs> even though I'll never love you. <laughs> no, I'm a kid and I'm friends with a bunch of British people. My nanny's British actually. And so the reason is because the British, they invaded Ireland. And they pretty much stole our national language. We were pretty much, like, we weren't allowed inside groups. Like, we weren't allowed, like, we were barely allowed inside groups higher than four people. Because, like, the British thought we would start a rebellion, would fight back. Like, if we were having a nice match of rugby or something, they would launch tanks into the fields. I know I'm making every person that's watching this against the British. But look, don't feel bad for yourself. It happened a long time ago. War is a war. Well, not for Kim Jong-un. <laughs> I shouldn't have said that on camera. <laughs> oh my god. Oh uh, no, I'm a you kidding. Actually, Kim Jong-un has made his first appearance in weeks, actually. In a public meeting. Uh, anyway. So, those are the Irish phrases. Uh, um, I hope you all enjoyed. And I will, oh yeah, and a little bit of Irish history. And in another episode, I'll be talking about 1916, the rising of the Irish people. Oh, God, that's one of my favorite times in Irish history, when we tried to fight them back. Now, I'm not saying that war is fun. War is definitely not fun. I mean, World War Two was bad. World War One was obviously really bad. But uh, anyway... We're all through those ages now. World War Three is probably going to come any time now. 
That thing back there is going to cause war with me now in a minute. Anyway, guys, um, I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>